All right, next mission. So this is my latest purchase. This is my fifth property. And this is gonna be the house I'm gonna live in next. So it's a three bed house. Um, obviously the place is in a right state. Here's a downstairs toilet. I'm gonna change it into a shower room. So there's still gonna be obviously a sink, a toilet, obviously everything brand new. It's gonna be a shower over there. Only little issue is there's a fuse box there and that's not allowed in the, in the bathroom or the shower room. So I'm gonna have to move it from that side to here, which is obviously the hallway. Now it should be all right, because obviously the door opens up this way. So should have enough clearance for it to not clash. If the door opened up the other way, then it might back onto the fuse box and that would be a little bit of a problem. So, so you got the stairs here. So obviously this is the hallway. The stairs are there. I'm gonna take you upstairs in a sec. This is the living room. Obviously it's all mash up and brack up and dirty and that, but you know what? There's certain people with their yard is in worse condition than this and they live in there, so. All right, what I've been doing is additional sockets. So here, the original socket's there. I've added the next one next to it. Same, there was one socket over there. I've added one next to it. Uh, there's a socket there. That's the original socket. I'm going to add at least two sockets next to it. And then run another socket for a TV one up there. So obviously my sofa and that is going to be over here. And obviously I'm going to be sitting down watching TV up there. So JYZ is going to have a TV in the living room <laughs> for the first time. Um, so yeah, it's going to be a socket up there. See, this is the kitchen. This kitchen is not staying, fam. This kitchen is going. It's going to be like a charcoal, so basically black, matte black kitchen. Um, the floor, maybe some sort of marble effect tile floor, maybe, or maybe some wood effect floor. I don't know yet. Still deciding. This is going to be the dining area here, so I'm going to be shooting my videos and that. There was... Uh, no, there was no sockets there. I've just added three sockets. Um, there's always a, there was an original socket over there. I've added the next socket next to it. There's the original socket there that's staying there. There's no additional sockets being added. There's going to be a TV in here. So when I have my dining table here, my dining table is going to be here. I'm going to have a TV over there so I can sit down and watch TV whilst I'm in my dining room area. Um, yeah. So yeah, the kitchens, what I'm going to do is, so the carcasses, I don't want to touch this because it's fucking filthy, but these are what the, these are the carcasses, so the base units, they're going to stay. I'm just going to clean them up, um, but I'm not removing the kitchen and that. With that little space there, that's, that's where the, the original freestanding cooker was. A freestanding cooker is a cooker that you can pull out and look behind. I'm going to make an integrated cooker, but the only issue is there might not be enough space so i might have to move these over a little bit so we'll see um yeah i'm gonna take you upstairs now obviously changing all the lights and that's so, all so far what i've done is i've just painted the ceilings painted the ceilings pretty much everywhere apart from this little pantry area i ain't bothered to touch that yet the reason why i haven't painted the walls because obviously i'm damaging the walls and that so i'm not gonna paint and then damage the walls. But the ceilings, there's no work to be done to it. So I just painted all the ceilings pretty much in every room. Apart from the bathroom upstairs and the toilet downstairs. I have not painted that. I ain't bothering to. Um, yeah, I did a little socket over there just in case. When you're an electrician, you go a bit mad with the sockets and that. Because you can. It's not costing you no extra. It's not. There's no extra cost in that. So Whereas if you're paying an electrician, a man might charge you extra 50, 60 pounds per point. So you're going to be... You're going to limit the amount of sockets you're going to have. So this is the bathroom. Um, yeah, this is going to get done last. What I need to do is I need to get a plumber in to cap off these pipes so I can remove the, um, the shower unit. Because there's going to be no electric shower unit. It's just going to be a normal shower. I'm going to rip out the bathtub. The boiler's in here. This is a system boiler, so it's one of those boilers where you have to heat up, you have to set the water to be heated at a specific time, and then when you open up the tap, then you get hot water. It's not like in most of you lot's yards, you got probably got a combi boiler, so no matter what time of day, you don't have to set the water to get heated up. 
you just open up the tap and after 20 seconds you get hot water. So I've got an old system boiler here. I might change it. I don't know, I'm gonna leave it for now. So this is gonna be the bedroom, like the main bedroom, this is gonna be my bedroom. So there was one socket over there, single socket, I've put two doubles. There was one socket over there again, single socket, I've put two doubles. Same over there. Uh, this is just a little cupboard, keep jackets and whatnot in there. Um, yeah, this is gonna be the second bedroom. So again, there was one socket over there, put two doubles. One socket over there, put two doubles. It's gonna be a little office room. Again, there was one socket over there, put two doubles. One socket over there, put two doubles. I was gonna put some sockets over there, but when I lifted up the carpet, there's normal floorboards, I believe, but then they've put plyboard, like sheets of wood. So I thought that's long, because if you take them up, you're more than likely gonna break them, and then that means you have something to replace. So I'm like, for the sake of adding some sockets there, Forget that, just run extension leave if I need some sockets over there. Yeah, that's that's about it for now. We'll be updating you lot with some more progress. Stay with us.